All right, so let's do a random map, tier one gear, and let's see what happens to us. Hopefully, it doesn't send me to high school. <laughs> but Grand, how you doing? Sunny Meadows. Shit. <laughs> ah, the Faz gods hate me. All right, there we go. A sneaky squirrel. Hello, Shao. Hello. But where were we playing, Grand? All right. Oh, don't. Oh, I got to take a flashlight in. Oh, this sucks. All right, let's take. You know what? I never bring in a tier one parabolic. Let's bring in a tier one parabolic. This is probably not going to be good. Uh, Tim Straffin, we got average 25. We got blowout, firelight, and we got ghost. Photo of the ghost. Oh, photo of the ghost with a tier three. I mean, tier one. What could, pos what, what could possibly go wrong? Yeah, the problem with the parabol a tier one parabolic is when you look in the store, it says wide beam. It's not a fracking wide beam, I don't think. It's almost, it's not directional, but it's pretty damn close to directional. That's some fun games on Phasmo. Nice. Hopefully the ghosts were decently nice to you. But welcome on in everybody. Anybody who's new to the channel. I'm Wolfen. I am a Phasmophobia streamer. I do stream some other stuff. Uh, actually, I play other stuff. I do tend to play most of my other stuff, though, over on YouTube. But yeah, but Grant, I also know you just got done. You just got done streaming. If you need to make sure you do your post care, if you need to raid and run, I totally get it. Because I'm gonna have to raid and run when I raid. Because I've got to. I've got to go get my flu shot. At least it's not high school. Well, looky there. This would have been worse if it was high school. Huh, I got lucky. Oh, there's our breath. Wait, is our breath here or in the hallway? Ah, it's more in the hallway. This is why I hate the CMF. <laughs> right, we're walking in the dark. Well, the nice thing about, so what I was going to say with like, especially like if you're trying to do, if you're using tier one parabolic, the nice thing about Sunny Meadows over high school is everything on Sunny Meadows is pretty much on one side. So you can like walk on one wall and then aim at the other wall while you're walking along and be able to, and be able to get your parabolic where with high school, everything, most of the hallways have things on both sides. So you almost have to sometimes go back and forth, which will which will cause you to sometimes miss uh, miss what miss the parabolic. So Sunny Meadows, as far as trying to do it with a tier one parabolic, actually is easier. And yes, you are going to see me walk a lot back and forth with no lights. Luckily, it's dark as hell, but luckily I've done this map enough that I kind of know where I'm going. And this is why you this is why you crouch walk. Cuz it's easy you kind of get a better a better view of everything. And downstairs actually is lighter than normal. It's kind of weird. We think it's in the blood room. Nope. Temperature went up. Okay. So, last time we had this happen. Every time that it tends to be like... 
more in the hallway than out here. It tends to be a banshee or a phantom. Where are you? A floating. Hey! A close encounter. Oh, trying to sneak in a Pulte there. I see what you're doing there. Uh, <laughs> yeah, probably. I see what you're trying to do there. Don't you know? All right, so we need to take this in. Uh, we need firelight. Take that in, take that in. Let's take that in. Sandy's at 63. Nope. Can't blame you for trying it all. Right, this spirit box. Um, so Wraith Phantom is an option. Just in case. Oh, thank you there, little blood. Little blood spot that makes it look like you're uh you're an orb. Kind of cheating. Well, I don't see orbs. All right. I'll get all the rest of the stuff I want in here, and then I'll grab the flashlight. Right, hiding spot is all the way at the end of the hall in the one room behind the uh, the big the big plushy chair or pleather, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, just a catch-up accident. It's okay. All right, we got Wraith. Take that. I already got a camera in there. Take that. And we're good. Do we have candle yet? Yep, we got candle. Good. And that should be it. It probably would have been smart of me to actually see what my sanity was, but but why does one need such knowledge? Oh, not a wraith. Uh, where'd I put the camera? There it is. That's probably not even in this room. Oh, it was. Hey, cool. Yeah, Unreo is an option. I don't think I had the bone, so that two star really doesn't matter.
Yeah, unfortunately, our hiding spot is way down that way. Come on, ghost. Ooh. Come here. Come out, come out wherever you are. Yeah, there's our hiding spot. Or the best natural hiding spot on this floor. Okay, that's two. That three second delay is so fracking, so fracking nasty. One evidence. One evidence, tier one gear only. And if I'm lucky, it's a Dio. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Nope, that doesn't count. All right, got one more picture for the ghost. So Onrio's out. Are you a Dio? Are you a Dio? Where are you? Come on, go. Take a noodle. All right, so we're not getting a ton of information here. Yeah. It's just a question. Are you a Dio? Yeah, I've been hearing other people have uh, issues with Onrio. I've not had that issue. But then again, if you put out multiple candles, I, it seems like people who put out multiple candles have more problems than those of us who only do one candle. Because if you got multiple candles, it's going to blow out the fourth. Because it's it has to, okay, so on, when it blows out the third candle, every third candle, it's either got to hunt, it's got to eat a crucifix, or it's got to blow out another candle that's nearby. Those are your three options. So that's why I just tend to always have, I just use one candle, because I want it to either hunt or eat a crucifix. Come on, ghost. What's my sanity at? I don't want to have to walk all the way out of San uh, uh, Sunny Meadows just to go look to see where my sanity is. There we go. Thank you. Well, at least now we know where we're getting. We can get hunted. Come on, be a Dio. There you go, Grimmy. Being nice to the ghost. See, that's the way you got to do it. Be polite to the ghost. They'll be polite back. Everything will be great. <laughs> it's trying. At least it only only has to eat one crucifix. Man, be patient. I'm probably going to die, by the way. 
So it's probably going to hunt in here. I'm going to have to wait for the grace period to end. I'm going to have to take the pick, and then I'm going to have to run and hope that it doesn't catch me within three seconds. Yeah. <laughs> Bloodthirsty. Yeah, that's not annoying. Come on. Ha! Oh, shit. Oh, I hate you. Ah, oh, shit, it's a Dio. <laughs> uh, I was so concerned about that ghost photo that I totally forgot that it could be a Dio. See, you guys have been wondering, have I? do I die to a Dio? Yes, I will forget that Dio is an option, especially in cases like this. <laughs> but yeah but cases like this where i will if like if i have to like try to get a picture of like with a tier three tier one camera and then try to run away i will totally forget that a do is an option and i will go into my hiding spot and i will block my butt in and i won't be able to and i will not be able to escape so there you go if if you ever wondered if i still died to a do yes i do but there you go. Tier one gear. <laughs>